Yeah, this is uh, the signature character here from Twisted Metal. Yep. Long and storied history. What made you want to put him in PlayStation All-Stars? It made a lot of sense for us to get you know, the clown out of the truck and, and really play up his personality a lot more than perhaps uh, the truck affords and to get some of the more essence of what that character is and sort of his brutal, his uh, sensibilities. What would you say from a beginner strategy, what's a good place to start with Sweet Tooth? Uh, Sweet Tooth is a very straightforward character in terms of his play style. It's really single individual moves. Um, he's really good at controlling space. Uh, most of that centers around his use of uh, his landmine. Uh, and his shotgun ability. Another one that grabbed me was the fire breathing. It's, uh, it, it, it takes a little bit of a commitment from the player, but you can hit multiple enemies and you can, and you can just carve right through them with this fire breath. The Molotov is, a, is really more of an annoyance move. It's not so much uh, a bread and butter type attack that you're going to be throwing out and hoping to generate gobs and gobs of AP with. Again, it's more of Sweet Tooth general place all capitalizing on your mistakes. Sweet Tooth also has a couple of effective uh, area of effect type juggles. There's one where he kind of pops a Molotov cocktail over his head and it sends guys flying up into the air. Let's talk supers. Sweet Tooth's level one super, bit of a niche move based yeah. on what I've seen. Dynamite plant and he sort of kicks you and sends you flying. It's clearly suited towards uh, attacking one person. Level two super with Sweet Tooth is killer. That's the guided nuke. It's right out of the nuke mode in the new Twisted Metal game. Yeah. Uh, the guided nuke, once it, it fires off the platform, Sweet Tooth has sort of entire complete control over the direction and the trajectory of that missile. He actually even pulls out a little PlayStation DualShock <laughs> and, uh, and controls it around the level. I mean, the level three speaks for itself. I mean, let's Sweet Bot, he's back, and, and, and it's, it's a little bit of a nod to how Kratos' uh, level three works, but it's different. It's got the chain gun that allows him essentially full screen uh, access if, if you're in front of Sweet Tooth and he pops Mecha Tooth and he starts that chain gun attack, uh, good luck to you. So sum it all up to close the book here on Sweet Tooth, what kind of what kind of player is going to gravitate towards Sweet Tooth? I, I actually think uh, Sweet Tooth is one of the easiest uh, characters on our roster to play. So maybe if you're just starting out and want a character that you can jump in very, very quickly and have some really success with, I think he'd be a great choice.